Hello friends, it's Miss Miller in the library. For this week we are learning about the Newberry Medal. And you can see the Newberry was um, named in honor of a man named John Newberry and it's awarded for the most distinguished contribution to American literature for children. So what is the Newberry Medal? The Newberry is the gold medal. It's awarded once a year. Um, uh, the medal itself says to American Litter for Children, but it can be any creative work created for children in that year. So the award can not only go to chapter fiction, which is actually um, the type of creative work that gets the award most often, but it could also go to any sort of nonfiction that's created for children, plays, poetry, graphic novels, etc. So who decides on who wins this medal every year? A committee of librarians get together. Normally in non-COVID times, they get together in person three times in the year, usually January, June, and then the next January. And throughout the year, they, um, between all the committee members, they try to read all the books that are new that year for children. Obviously, no one person can read all of them. That is a huge undertaking. Every year, there are thousands of books that are um, created for children. But between all the committee members, they try to really, you know, look at the whole spectrum of creative works that have been made for children that year. And throughout that year, they're reading, 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 they're discussing. A lot of it is done virtually now, even before COVID times. They got together and met regularly, usually like through Zoom or Google Meet, um, email, et cetera conference calls, and they keep winnowing down that pool of what they think is the best. And they debate and argue and defend what they think is the best thing that was created for books for, for kids that year. Until finally, usually at the American Library Association conference, the midwinter conference that's usually held the end of January, they make the announcement. The authors do not know until that announcement is made. Like usually um, the ceremony where the formal announcement is made usually starts at like something really early, like 7.30 in the morning, and they will call the authors right before they make the public announcement to give them the heads up. And then they make the public announcement. Um, the 2020 Newbery Medal winner was New Kid by Jerry Craft, and it's a graphic novel about a student from Washington Heights, a neighborhood in New York City, that is starting at a new elite private school. And um, this is not the first graphic novel to win, but it is among the first. There are not a lot of graphic novels that have won the Newbery Award. Uh, the 2019 winner was uh, Mercy Suarez Changes Gears by Meg Medina. And this is actually, ironically, also about um, a student who's just having trouble fitting into their private school. But in Marcy's case, she's also... At the same time, she's having trouble fitting in at the school. She has a much beloved grandfather who's been a major part of her life. And her grandfather is starting to struggle with forgetting things, which is, um, you know, a heartbreaking process when we have older relatives that are going through that. The 2018 winner is a book called Hello Universe by Erin Entrada Kelly. And this is a um, realistic uh fiction book about four very different kids and what happens when one kid pulls a prank on one of the other kids and one of the four ends up trapped in a well with his pet guinea pig um you know who doesn't love a pet guinea pig and the 2017 Newbery Medal winner was The Girl Who Drank the Moon by Kelly Barnhill. And this is a fantasy novel about a girl who's coming into her magical powers and must use them to protect the people um, around her. Um, here on this slide, we have um, images of the covers, and those images are linked to sort of book trailers that'll help give you an idea of what the book is about. So I'd like you to click on these images, listen to those trailers, and um, let me know which one you think you would be most interested in. All right. Thanks, friends. Take care. I'll see you next time.